heading now to the pool. Apparently, the pool reopens today after uh, after uh, uh, I don't know two months without or being closed. So, gonna swim for the first time in two and a half months. I don't think I've ever taken this long of a break out of swim. Can't really curb my enthusiasm. Eh, actually, I can. I don't. I don't. I don't like. I don't, I don't like swimming that much. <laughs> so, let's see what's the uh, first feeling or first reaction after so long without swimming. After my first swim back, it, it all, I always struggle. I actually felt better than I was expecting. I think the dry land exercises and the swim cords really keep you keep your body refreshing on on how to properly do a stroke. Um, I always struggle with coming back to the pool, always with the breathing side. So I always feel like the breathing is completely off. I run out of breath. So I really focused on staying calm and collected when I swim on the, my first way back. Also, um, did some drill exercises, some sculling. Um, used um, the snorkel as well, to, so the, the, the breathing would not be so much of an issue. Um, I think it's important that now that I'm coming back to swimming after so long of a break and every time I take time off uh, swimming, I think it's important to just focus on technique a little bit. Also try to take the most out of the time where we were not swimming to try to forget about the things that we doing, were doing unconsciously. Um, so it was a good opportunity or this is a good opportunity to really focus on technique for a few weeks and then starting to build up that volume and intensity back to 20, 20, 25, 30k a, a week, which was, which is now the gold standard for swimming in triathlon. So you have to be swimming 25 to 30,000 uh, meters or yards a, a week to really uh, push through. Okay, yeah, that that's it. So that was way better than I thought. I mean, I actually felt better than I was expecting and was actually... I'm really excited for the next few weeks where I actually get to swim again. Yeah, thanks for watching guys.